Hi, I'm DeAndrea. I'm here at the Children's Museum coming to you from the ConocoPhillips Math Lab. And today I'm going to do an activity called Odds and Ends. And I would like to thank ConocoPhillips for bringing this activity to us today. So today we're going to do an activity called Odds and Ends. And all you're going to need is a set of dominoes for the activity. Now we have our dominoes and we're going to turn over two dominoes at one time. So we're going to add the numbers on the dominoes. So here I have 2 plus 6, which is 8. So I have 8, and then I have 1 plus 4 is 5. So I'm going to multiply these two together. 8 times 5 equals 40. So I want to know if this is an even number or an odd number. Even numbers you count by twos. You can count by twos to get to, like 2, 4, 6, 8. 10. Odd numbers are the other numbers that are not, that you cannot count by two, like one, three, five, seven, nine. So is this even or odd? It's an even number because I can count by twos to get to the number. So I can't keep that because we're looking for odd numbers. So I have to turn these two back over. So now I have 5 plus 2, which is 7, and I have 1 plus 5, which is 6. 7 times 6 is 42. Can't keep those, that's even. I have 4 plus 4, which is 8. 2 plus 0 is 2. 8 times 2 is 16. I can't keep those. Okay, I have 0 plus 0, which is 0. 1 plus 1 is 2. 2 times 0 is 0. I can't keep those. I have two plus zero is two, and I have three plus six is nine. Nine times two is 18. I can't keep those. I have two plus one, which is three. I have two plus five, which is seven. Seven times three is 21. I have an odd number, so I get to keep these. Now I have an odd number. I'm gonna continue doing this until I get three odd numbers and then I win. It's also good if you have another player. So get your parent or guardian to help you out. My name is DeAndrea Edwards coming to you from the math lab. Please leave a comment if you like this activity. Thank you.